first to know in Sempi TV. Minister of Justice and Attorney General, Godfred Yeboa Dami, Akupimu, the floor of Parliament. Now, what church in Sempi Bribe move with regards to some prominent cases? Ghana for doing any DH3, especially murder cases involving some prominent members of the society. JB Dankwa Adu, the late, the late Infantiman MP, the late investigative journalist Amel Swali, and a host of other prominent dignities. Now, Godfrey Yabuadame, I make a series of shocking revelations, specifically. In the case of Ahmed Hussein Swali, Enra Ewagana Mashibijo. Ye be go through the right up Ewa Eha na di hian chirimono. Ya chirimu di hiase yebeko down memory lane niya kaka ya honsu. Ye beko niya kaka ya hon niya baba ba sim se de beya and tia siye ebe ye e juma ewa sase. Now, Godfrey Yabwa dami e chirimwa following intelligence on nipan kasa or mum meda Ahmed Hussein Swali. Omo etumi APK four suspects. One, aye Edward Gatsin Kofi Goka. Two, aye Musa Idrisu Elias Yapudu. Three, aye Francis Osei Puku Elias Atemuda six six six. And a four, aye Abdul Rashi Mezungu Elias. Kakalika the devil. Kakalika the devil. Tinipa and Nai, and according to Godfrey de Wadame, upon intelligence omo pekiye, omo etumi achi omo as suspects. Yana omo bua in investigation. Na ochina mose during investigation, omo tsenya two crucial witnesses. Yana omo ye available at the crime scene. Embra ni pa boni fono edi moto nube druho e bo Ahmed Swali two. Emma and Wu Yeno. There were these two witnesses at the crime scene. Yeah, be be a cause to be a woman here. The Yanko Pony Adom, these two crucial witnesses were ready and available to aid the police in the investigation of the murder, the gruesome murder of Ahmed Hussein Swali. Now, interestingly, according to Godfrey Yabadami, these two crucial witnesses were able to give vivid description of the two suspects on the motorbike that murdered Ahmed Hussein Swan. Vivid description. And to these two witnesses, it to me, Chre Muye Nipa Mienua Omudi Ahmed Hussein Swale, a woo ya ya ya. Emra Ombon to Nipa Mienu to me this cab. And I told you, General Chimuse, a request was made. To the Department of Geomatic Engineering, that was coming from the University of Science and Technology, for the use of satellite imagery, sketching of the assailants from the description of the witnesses, and after the use of telecommunication network. And the vivid description of these two witnesses at the Mayano of Sergio Sosbenzi Tiano, and according to the Attorney General, Godfrey Abadami. Or more contacted Department of Geomatic Engineering, a work in UST. So, on the board, now on the satellite imagery, sketching, and after the use of telecommunication network, and to me, I'm going to depart me a new party. Yeah, I'm going to me a D. I'm a Swale Hussein, a woo ya ya ya. No, as I chair, which the parliament is based on recommendation of the Department of Geomatic Engineering, King UST. Two witnesses, you know were presented before forensic artists on January the 27th, 2019. Now, after listening and recording the description of the assailant, the forensic artist from the geomatic department of the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology had to be sketchy two artistic images of the suspects through the description of these two witnesses. Emma, these two witnesses 
e confirm say the sketch images e a perfect resemblance of the two axillas ya o momeda amed go sin soale perfect resemblance e you mo pe 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 ni pe me no di amed go sin soale wu no these two witnesses ya no more the crime scene e mra the forensic artist from geomatic engineering department of queen university e to be draw mo no say ah and go for me no pe 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 now following up intelligence report and a suspect edward gatsen kofi goka musa idrisu francis osei puku and abdul rashid mezongu police arrested him and attorney general it said chile mu biyo say some four suspects they were taken through thorough investigation process at the police cid head office to omo undergo all the investigation process we here you know and omo to omo safre these two eye witnesses ya no omo at the crime scene say omo mra na omo identify say nipa foi me enu ya omo ye so sure say omo the committee the murder of ame hussein swali ya ya draw omo omo agya to say omo ano me enu wo say nipa nan ya omo ye suspect police for actual omo ye omo undergo investigation no ana but unfortunately these two witnesses and to me identify any of the said as assailants from the four suspects the nipa na yinna edward gatsin kofi goka musa idrisu francis osei poku and abdul rashid mezongu no according to the two witnesses nipa me no mo hu omo so mo timoto so mo ne to ame so le tu oku omo ne de and nay emubia and come the sanity according to the attorney general the four suspects were subsequently granted police enquiry bail ya na omuguso e assist investigations and the attorney general say or catch the criminal investigation department of the Ghana police service say aided by the forensic artist omo santin him na omo enya omo toro investigation e hwe so omo benya new suspects ya omo betumi amaach the forensic artist from the geomatic engineering department of KUST upon the description of the witnesses but according to the office of the attorney general e be seen there no docket fit for prosecution or action has been presented to his office by the criminal investigation department of the Ghana police e be seen there we be as a look at bias and metal office. The attorney general just said, We're making request upon request upon request, but a busy now what the floor of parliament here can say. Not a single docket on the directive of the mind has been presented by the criminal investigation department. And according to the attorney general, and you're very correct to say that he has not ceased moving on that matter. The attorney general is pointing out to say, why nya several meetings with relevant stakeholders, including the former IGP and the current IGP, to solve this particular homicide case and other homicide cases. Was it just last week or you inquire about the state of investigations into the scene? A man demanded a report on the status of investigations. Ya yeah, wo mo say the director general of the CID together with the um, IGP at this report no e be upon this request na o ma present a document giving an account of work done so far on the Ahmed Swalis murder case na e bi the attorney general essentially mo say Omo wo in their possession two empty shells of nine by one nine nine millimeter cartridges and ammunition that were found on the ground where Ahmed Hussein Suwale was examined. Omo say enya three empty shells of nine by nineteen millimeter ammunition also found 
e wo ka kro no ana Ahmed Swale wo sin e gina enchen no a enkofo no e bo ntu iku no e no mo san hu 9 by 29 mm 3 empty shell ammunition e no so inside the car ya na Ahmed Swale wo sin e gina enimo e bi o an i47 plus mobile phone and a Huawei smartphone belonging to Ahmed Hussein Swali. Ya omuhu no at the crime scene also no. According to the attorney general Godfrey Yabadam, it is in the possession of the CID. Now a sign can the chair parliament to say, on January 7, 2019, an autopsy was performed on the body of the deceased Ahmed Hussein Swali by Dr. Osei Gusufri, ya or ya pathologist at the police hospital. Now, it was identified by a paternal uncle of the deceased, ex warrant officer class one, Al Haji Mahama, in the presence of the police. Now, according to Godfrey Yawadami, the pathologist, Emma, entering cause of death as one, hemorrhagic shock, two, severe chest injury as a result of the gunshot, and a three, a perforated lungs as a result of a gunshot at close range. And the way Emone and some kaka go for your body, I mean, it to you. We are not sure more. Other exhibits at the crime scene also were the police forensic science laboratory for ballistic examination. The way any details kaka, um, you are go for it, your boy, dummy. Eddie Emma Ghana Emma Sebe John for Emma Okupiemo on the floor of Parliament. And they are on the murder of Ahmed Hussein Swali. About to engage uh, in the next few days to restart uh, the taxi link, mm -hmm. and then it will be missing the um, control tower. The control tower, what is missing there is the installations, MEP installations, finishing and equipment. All the exterior of the control tower and the fire uh, building is already concluded. Do have done this, the airport management can migrate here to this terminal mm -hmm. and the control tower can migrate also for the new control tower. Then once this is done, we will demolish the old facilities. The reasons for that, that we have this terminal is that old facilities, they are too near the runway in order to comply with the international rules of an uh, international airport. Mm. Done that demolitions, we will do uh, um, access for the fire department directly to the runway and that is the conclusion of the project. Okay, now you were talking about uh the runway works, the extension. Yes. How many, how long will it, will it take you to do that? We will need there for at least three months. Three to months. Do, to do that. Okay, but like I did to you at the other place, yeah, 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 I have to reduce the We will the, do our best. <laughs> so, uh, because we've paid you money, uh, as of, uh, I think, 12 December, mm -hmm. we released some 7 million uh, euro yes. uh, for you to remobilize and uh, bring the, the, the project to uh, completion. Uh, there is an outstanding of about 2 million euro. Mm -hmm. We are going to make sure that that is also released over the next one week so that we do not expect this project mm -hmm. to delay even by a day any longer. Mm -hmm. And so instead of three months, we are talking about um, February, March, February, is yeah, almost like, 10 February. March, <laughs> March, April, so May. March, April, May. So <laughs> I want you to do this by the end of April complete all works all outstanding works we will try okay. is in a certain way yes, yes. Mm -hmm. is possible but also depends a lot on how we are helped no, with the weather that. no 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 it is possible it is possible because if by the weather you cannot complete by the end of april how can you complete them by the end of yeah. may because you are faced with the same weather so please no excuses i will ask your help to stop no, 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 some no, of the operations no, no, no excuses because we only can work at no, night no, no excuses because funding was the issue okay as a result of the debt suspension but now you have no excuse because we have already paid seven million euro out of the nine million that was outstanding and we are going to work to get the outstanding two million euro to be paid to you 
So we won't take any, any excuses about further delays in this project. So by the end of April, I will hold you to this. Right. Are we aligned? We are aligned to, to do our <laughs> best on that. <laughs> by the end of April, I will come back here with the minister. You know, when I spoke to the minister for transport before coming here, he gave me um, indication that you are a very good contractor. The work you have done is so good. And so he has no doubt that once all the money is made available, you are going to complete this project as scheduled. Uh, so we will do the best that we can. You know, His, His Excellency the President is so committed to this project. Okay. And it's so unfortunate that uh, we had some challenges. Yeah. But we have gone beyond that. That is why we have found money to pay you. And we're going to pay the balance of 2 million euro to you. And this is why we won't take any further excuses. We've already done so much. I'm, I'm very happy about what I've seen here. I'm not an engineer, so I can attest to the quality. Uh, you know, the engineers will tell us. But what I've seen on the face of it shows that we've, we've, we've done a good job. And therefore, we want you to carry it to its uh, logical conclusion. So end of April is the deadline. We appreciate you. I appreciate you. Cap people, uh, so that we are able to determine whether the, 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 the airport, the project has been delivered to specification. But if I have to comment on what I have seen on the face of it, I can tell you that I'm very impressed about what I have seen. You know, uh, but it also means that uh, this project would have been completed uh, some time ago but for the challenges that we, we faced. Uh, having said that, we have made uh, efforts, renewed efforts, to address uh, those challenges. And uh, as I indicated earlier, uh, part of the outstanding uh, amount of money which was to be paid for the project to resume has been uh, paid to the, to the contractor. What is left is about just two million uh, euro which we are going to do uh, within one week uh, so that the contractor will have no uh, excuse uh, as far as funding is concerned to work to bring this uh, to, to, to completion. So um, I'm very impressed. I want to thank them for the, the job, the good job, but I'm impressing upon them uh, to make sure that by end of April uh, they, they bring a closure to, to this project so that we can begin to use it and to drive the benefits uh, that this airport will bring to this region and to the country. He made some assurances um, to the Asante and the regional minister on completion of major projects like the Confounder Chief Teaching Hospital, Madam Baby Unit. You were there. What were some of the challenges you observed? And well, of course, began? the hospital has challenges and uh, we are going to begin to uh, give uh, some agency. I mean, uh, we are in our the last year of our term, and so we should work to get them uh, to appreciable level of conclusion. Uh, but I'm very optimistic that we are going to break the eight, the good works we are doing, what the president has delivered to the people of Ghana. Uh, I believe will be reciprocated by the people of Ghana by keeping our party uh, in government, uh, so that uh, we can start new projects and complete those we haven't. Uh, completed uh, yet. So thank you.